Hey everyone, it's Raj from 3CB. Lakers big Anthony Davis suffered a left ankle injury in the fourth quarter of the team's eventual win over the Nuggets on Thursday night. AD was able to play on and both coach Frank Vogel and AD were very optimistic that he would play on Saturday in game five. The question then becomes, how would the medical and training staffs treat those next two days to give AD the best chance of playing as close to 100% as possible? There's two key things they're focusing on throughout the period, swelling and pain. Now, generally, those two things get a bad rap. Swelling is actually the body's healing response, and pain is the brain telling the body, hey, guy, don't do that movement. However, in this shortened timeline, limiting those is the main challenge. So to do that, treatment would have began right after the game. The combination of modalities of just using ice, using e-stim, and then using hands-on therapy to help reduce the swelling and pain. And also, this is critical, gentle active range of motion to help flush some of that swelling back into the lymphatic system. Now moving to Friday, first they would assess how he's feeling, and then based on that, potentially increase the aggressiveness of the hands-on treatment, plus modalities, plus the active range of motion, and then get some light work in on the court to see how he's moving and see how he's responding. Moving into Saturday, it's again the same process. First, assess how he's feeling, then based on that, a stepwise progression throughout the day of around the clock treatment, modalities, hands-on, active range of motion, and then progressing his on-court movement as well to not only assess how he's feeling, but then to actually observe how he's actually moving and how he's able to handle the intensity of some of those in-game actions. In this case, considering it's a big playoff game with the Lakers on the brink of going to the finals and Denver fighting for their collective playoff lives, the coaching, medical, and training staffs will likely give more of a cushion for AD to be able to play in the game, whereas in a regular season game, he may have been just ruled out from the get-go. The key thing in general throughout these two days is the medical and training staffs having a methodical plan to gradually build AD up to game time and then, depending on how he feels, potentially utilizing an ankle wrap or taping the ankle in order to give him some extra support and give that extra boost as he goes into the game.